I have to tell you, as, uh, as we continue to read, uh, you know, the scientific community is uh, providing more and more uh, just evidence. Uh, you read it from the New England Journal of Medicine. Uh, and as I continue to read, that uh, more and more of the babies are surviving, you know, 20 weeks post-fertilization, and, and I am reading of the scientific data that uh, the babies at, uh, at, at 20 weeks have the, uh, the pain receptors. They can feel and experience pain. Um, so, you know, to me, uh, it's just humane for us to care for the babies. And uh, I, I just can't, it's unconscionable to me that they could potentially be put through pain. Uh, we have now, uh, uh, you know, surgeons uh, that are doing uh, surgeries and uh, there's, there is anesthesia, obviously, when the mother receives that and uh, they're, they're, the baby would not be in pain. They're doing very good uh, life-saving and life-changing operations in the womb. So uh, I just think it's time that, uh, that we care for the babies uh, within and without of the womb, uh, especially. I mean, I, I understand about, you know, a woman's choice and different opinions and, and trying to respect uh, various uh, points of view on this, uh, on this emotional issue. But I don't think anybody wants to see a baby experience pain. I, I, I just, to me, I don't think any of us really, whatever your position is. Mm -hmm.